Hi, my name is Aaron Haycock, and I am the owner of Melt, a gelato and espresso and candy store in Newtown, Detroit. Um, opened just a few months ago, and I'm uh, looking forward to the spring and summer season. All right, how'd you get started? Uh, I always liked the idea of owning my own business, and um, Detroit seemed like a, the perfect opportunity to do such a thing with cheap rent and, and uh, lots, of, lots of space, and uh, you know, lack of amenities, so it just seemed like the right fit. All right. Um, so, you know, you kind of touched on this, but, you know, why did you choose Detroit versus, say, the suburbs or another major city? Um, well, I am just a city person, and I just, you know, I'm not, I'm also not from the area. So, Detroit is the only place in Michigan I've ever lived, and um, just an emotional attachment, I guess, to it, really more than anything. But, uh, you know, the neighborhood, the area in which the store is, is, is underserved. For sure. Um, you know, has, has Midtown been pretty receptive of you guys being in here? Yeah, so far so good. You know, I've only been here four months and, um, you know, it, we, we have so far survived the harshest winter in the last 64 years, so I would say yes. Uh, it'll be interesting to see what happens over the next few months. All right, um, so what have some of the challenges been of, you know, owning and operating the city, or a business in the city? Well, um, I would say the biggest challenge would be uh, the time it took to build. Um, I haven't really had an issue with the city, per se, but I've never opened, owned a business anywhere else, so I don't have a base comparison. But construction took a really long time, and so we ended up opening in the fall, so it would be summer, which was obviously a major setback. Yeah. Okay. Um, would you say that the Detroit you know, name and you know, brand affects your business at all? Uh, I honestly don't think so in this case. Um, I, tr I tried my best to keep this as like a general public place as possible, a place that could be in any city, um, and that wasn't Detroit specific because the long term goal is to branch out in other cities. Okay. Um, do you have any advice that you would give to someone thinking about opening or moving a business to the city? I would say pack a lot of patience. <laughs> um, Really, that's about it. I think it's going to take three or four times longer. All right. Um, that's pretty much all I got. You know, if someone was to come here, do you guys have some sort of signature drink that they should try? Absolutely. Our signature drinks, of course, are specialties. They are uh, essentially latte-style drinks that can be made hot, iced, or blended. And we um, put gelato in with the espresso and make a sweet drink out of it. You can also add any type of syrups or toppings to it and just create your own you know, sweet confectionery drink, grass coffee. All right, well, thank you, that's all I got. All right, thank you.